Okay, in this tutorial, we will learn how to do safety analysis on a car body. And uh, in order to determine left hand track, the software we will be using is Ansys Fluid. First of all, you have to create your geometry uh, as I have created it in Pro Engineers, my core body. Now you have to save it in IGS format or step format so that it can be loaded or imported into Ansys Workbench. For example, I save it in IGS format and uh, another thing you should um, keep in mind that all your files associated to your project that is the analysis on your core body the geometry file and uh, ANSYS file should be in the same folder now as I click save export IGS it means that we want to export surfaces solid shells or so I will select solids uh, this will be evident uh, as we do our uh, analysis in fluent and the other thing is that uh, coordinate system export we want to export our coordinate system also so click ok now this is saved now we open our uh, ANSYS workbench here uh, as we want to do analysis in fluent so in the toolbox double click fluid flow fluent in order to load it into a project schematic okay now here we can give a name to our uh, project for example we give it car analysis we will also save it in the start in the same folder where our geometry file is located we will give the name is car analysis now uh, if you want to do 3D analysis or 2D analysis you can select it from here the, here is analysis type 2D or 3D it should be selected at the start of your uh, project I select 3D as you want to do 3D analysis now in order to import our geometry right click on geometry icon import geometry browse and go to your file there is common now double click to open design model as our units geometry units are in millimeters so we will work in millimeters it is imported but in design modeler you have to complete each command by clicking the generate button so when we click generate button it will be loaded here ok so this is our car body we, we will now create an enclosure around this that is our uh, artificial wind tunnel in which uh, we will do analysis over this body it means that uh, we will create our domain of air around this body in order to calculate drag and lift forces over it you can check it from here that um, it is a solid body and also here you can give it a name is car body so that you can uh, identify it easily over here 
okay the next thing is that we will create a domain of air around our core body there are two ways and that you can do it and uh, there are some problems that uh, occur in it the first way is that you create an enclosure around your core body so first we will want to see where our coordinate axis lies it is here the next thing is that as you can see that I have uh, trimmed my wheels a little bit this is uh, due to the fact that if they are perfectly um, circular then uh, when I make enclosure around my core body and then perform boolean operation in order to subtract this core body from our domain it gives an error of uh, that uh, the result will be a non-manifold body non-manifold